Do you remember your childhood? And did you grow up in or near a city? Today, there are more than a billion children growing up in cities. While this provides urban families with opportunities and conveniences, it also brings big challenges. Many families, especially those living in poverty or in informal settlements, are particularly vulnerable. All babies, toddlers, and caregivers benefit in transformational ways from better planning and design that takes their needs into account. Why is this important? Babies are full of potential and their environment shapes their brains and their future. A baby's brain creates one million synapses every second. They adapt and learn so fast that their experience in the first five years of life impacts their health, education, social life, and professional success into adulthood. But even knowing this, the reality is that there are still 250 million children under five around the world that don't receive the care they need to thrive. Not having safe and healthy places to play, missing close contact with nature, a lack of safe walking routes and accessible mobility options, or living in a densely polluted area influences the development of young children. Stressful urban environments also impact caregivers, who play an essential role in the healthy development of babies and toddlers. It is caregivers who create opportunities for love, play, conversation, and nurture. They provide a stable presence, protecting children from stress, and are the most fundamental element in their brain building. Imagine if you were three again, taking your first steps through a busy city. Which difficulties would you encounter? Which dangers would you fear? Where would you want to explore? If you could experience the city from 95 centimeters, the height of a healthy three-year-old, what would you change? Urban 95, an initiative of the Bernard Van Leer Foundation, seeks the answer to this question. By working with city leaders, planners, architects, and engineers to support the healthy development of young children growing up in cities. After years of research, innovation, networking, and practice, we have learned that families need clean air, the effects of poor air quality are felt disproportionately by the youngest, and especially those in low-income areas, causing lifelong consequences in their health. Nature. Exposure to natural environments for play, exercise, and rest is beneficial for mental and physical health at all ages. Proximity to services and healthy spaces, ensuring that key earlier services and spaces are accessible by foot, bicycle, or reliable public transport, provide support to caregivers and the children they care for. With this in mind, we support and invest in services and spaces that transform cities into healthy environments, where public spaces are vibrant, comfortable, and encourage supportive communities. We promote a neighborhood planning that ensures caregivers with young children can reach their destinations and key services in a safe, convenient, and affordable way. Urban 95 is now expanding to reach 63 partner cities around the world. By working with local and global partners, we aim to scale projects with the greatest potential, with funding, resources, and technical support. Urban design, planning and policies that focus on the needs of babies and toddlers help cities to care for the most vulnerable members of our society. Focusing on the early years can also ensure a city's climate resilience, carry enormous economic benefits, and offer a platform for investment that has the ability to unite political forces. Urban 95 creates healthy, fair, safe and vibrant cities for young children and those who care for them. Because a city that works for babies, toddlers and their caregivers is a city that works for everyone.